coffee, so I think I'll be good today. Hopefully. <laughs> Hey guys, so I don't know if I talked. Oh yeah, I did. Okay, but um, I just got home. As you guys saw, I went to the Cheesecake Factory. Um, I was supposed to get the ramen with my coworker, but I think we're just gonna save that for Sunday because I'm gonna go to work Sunday instead of tomorrow because I have a bridal shower for my cousin um tomorrow, so I won't be able to go to work. But we're probably gonna get the ramen Sunday, hopefully. Also, we went to the Cheesecake Factory. I also went to Zara. I finally found myself a coat. Um, and I got a couple things from there. Something from H&M. And something from Forever 21. Which I'm going to show you guys right now. Because I don't think I'm going to film a haul video. Um, but I got those. And then I also got... What else did I get? Oh no, I went to Target and I got a few things. But... I'll show you some of them as well, but I just got like food and snacks also because I've been really hungry at night, as you guys might have known. Um, I got some oatmeal cookie things. I got some haagen -Dazs because they were two for seven, which is still a lot for the pint, but they were on sale, so I had to grab them. Everyone was like hogging up the door trying to look for what flavor. I just grabbed two vanillas because you guys know I'm so basic, but... Um, I'm just gonna chill. I'm so happy that I don't have work just because I can kind of sleep in a little bit and um, I can like take my time getting ready. I think I'm gonna curl my hair tomorrow. I'll also show you guys the outfit that I bought for tomorrow so you guys can see. Um, and then I'm gonna watch finish watching The Haunting of Hill House if that's what it's called. I keep forgetting it's such a weird name. Everyone keeps messing it up. But I'm going to continue watching that. I'm already like on the fifth episode, which is crazy because there's so many series that I started, like Castle Rock, that I'm only on the second episode. Insecure is practically, I think it's over already, um, the third season. And I'm only on the second episode again. I think it's just like so many at one time, but this one I just played it on my TV and I just kept rolling with it. But um, I think it's better on my TV than my laptop maybe. That's why I don't finish them because if I watch it on my laptop... Then I end up trying to like go into other pages to browse stuff and then I end up pausing it because I can't see what's on the screen. But having it on a TV plus being on my computer, I don't have to use my TV to browse the internet. So I can browse while watching it. So that's why I should be using that thing more often. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to do that. But I'm just going to grab all the stuff that I got so I can show you guys what I bought today. So hang on one momento. So this is going to be in random order, but there might be a little bit of a shadow on my face. It's because of my light, the, um, I had this set on this little table outside of my bed. But this is going to be in random order. I'm just going to start with whatever's next to me. Um, so at Target, um, my floors are tile and I have a rug right now that you guys might have noticed. It's like a reddish Mediterranean style rug or Persian style rug that I got from Ikea and it just covers this empty area of my floor that's the biggest open area that I walk through but when I get off the side of my bed my floor is really cold in the morning um when I step down so I wanted something to keep right there to kind of like help with that <laughs> like a rug um and this one is actually on sale for nine bucks so I decided to pick it up and this is from the brand Threshold. they have really nice stuff so it's just this like yellow, I didn't even realize it has a bird on it, whatever. But it's like this really nice yellow mustardy color and I feel like it will really go with the Mediterranean style I have going on um, and the colors. So I just got that. So I could just set it on the side of my bed so when I step off it keeps me nice and warm. From the Target brand, as you guys see I have these bins everywhere. These are just like gray ones that I got. And I put my socks and underwear in one and then the other one I use for my hair stuff. But I'm still running out of space, so I got two more and I actually got them in green. 
So this first one I got just looks like this. It's like a hunter green color. And then I got another one. So these were, I believe, $5 each, which is really great because these other ones are lasting me really, really well. So these ones I think I'm gonna keep underneath my TV because the color looks a little bit better. And then the two gray ones I'll put underneath my desk. From h and I didn't really see like any accessories that I really wanted. So I ended up just getting this t-shirt that I found in like the Halloween section because they had like these fake Halloween costumes. There was like one piece suit and stuff. But they had like a Buffy the Vampire t-shirt, a Gremlins one, and I never watched any of those. So the only one I got was The Exorcist. And this one I just thought looked really cool. Um, I got mine in a large because I want to be oversized, but I just thought this was really, really awesome. And this was 13 bucks, which I thought was okay because the quality feels a little bit good. Um, and not really like see-through or anything, and I just love the print of it. Like I like how it goes all the way down to the bottom, so really cute, really like this. Really awesome, and I'm going to be rocking this pretty soon. Zara, um, I just got this random t-shirt. They have a lot more that I want to get. But this was $9.90, which is really cool, really good price. And I don't know, everyone's been loving the leopard print or cheetah print, whatever it is. And I just got this t-shirt in a size large, again, because I like my stuff oversized. And it's just this cheetah print t-shirt. As you guys see, I have my cheetah print bag. Um, of course, it won't match because that one's pink and this is brown. But I could just tuck this in some pants and wear it. It look really cool. I could still wear it to work because it looks work appropriate. Um, it's not really like, I don't know. I just like the print of it. It's really nice boxy tee and it's really, really good quality for what I feel. And then the jacket I got, which is kind of hard that it's going to be hard to see, but you'll see me wearing it sometime soon. And it's just this faux fur black coat which you can't really tell, but it's kind of like a short coat, not too long, but I got this and most of these coats, they don't really come with closures. So this one luckily had buttons that you can close, which is what I really like. And it's collar collarless, which is what I also really like because when I wear scarves, I don't want to have a collar on top of that. And I just like the way this looks without a collar on me instead of stuff with collars. It just makes me look really like, it just suffocates me almost. So wearing this with even like hoodies underneath so I could put the hood out and stuff it'll really work well it feels really warm and thick and I thought it was like $69 until my total came up to $49 I believe I realized that this was oh no it is $69 but I only paid $39 so that means it was like half off wow that's crazy I hope like nothing's like wrong with it though I don't know where I would have gotten it from it looks like everything is intact with it. Hmm, that's crazy. Well, I guess I just scored a deal today. I'm going to tell my sister about that because I was even asking her why is it a different price. Um, and the last place I went to was Forever 21. I'm going to show you these bags because as you guys know in my favorite video that I had, um, I had this corduroy black bag that I wear all the time. And then I found, let me show you the other two first. I found a bunch more so I found this rusty orange one which is of course screams fall and you know it's just a regular canvas tote bag can hold a lot um then I got one in a corduroy green one this is the first one I saw and I was like I have to get it it's just this like hunter green corduroy one I believe the orange one is like a little bit bigger than the corduroy ones yeah it is and then this one, which I thought was like really just cute. It looks a little bit tacky, I think. Like it might not match a lot of stuff, but I wear a lot of browns and stuff. So I thought maybe it'll match me. Who knows? Um, and it's just this plaid fuzzy one, which I really, really like. And it's just like so cozy. I've been loving cozy bags, as you can see. But this just feels very like, I just want to snuggle in it. So those were all like, this one was seven something. This one was like five something. And this one was like three bucks. So, really great price. Can't beat that. And then for my outfit, which you'll also see tomorrow for the bridal shower, I just got this jumpsuit and this was, I believe, 25 bucks. It's just this navy blue with this tie knot front and the legs just go like wide leg all the way down. And I'm going to wear it with these blue silk like satin shoes they're like two-toned they're blue and they're 
um i mean they're dark blue and they're light blue i think i brought them home if not that'll really really suck if i didn't but yeah i'm gonna wear those or i'll just wear any high heels that i have that will look fine because i don't have time to go back to work to go get those shoes but that was my little mini haul now i'm just gonna relax for a little bit edit tonight's or yesterday's vlog and then watch some hill house and snack on some snacks and i'll get back to you guys <laughs> in a minute which will probably be like a couple hours of course but hopefully today was a little bit more interesting i think it was because i actually like try to film as i was going out like doing errands at work and stuff as you guys saw um i made like keys and stuff and copies and things i don't know but it was a very fulfilled day but um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this little haul and i'm gonna tune out for a little bit and i'll see you guys a little bit later so guys i've had a long long day so i think i'm actually gonna knock out right now um i'm on episode six of the haunting of hill house and it got really good on episode five like the end of it that explained so so much but um yeah i'm just gonna knock out because it's already like 11 p.m and yeah of course i still want to sleep in but i can't sleep in too too late because i have to leave by like midday like 12 to get ready to go because it starts at 2 or 2 30 i think but i just want to make sure that i'm there on time and i have enough time to get ready so on that note i'm gonna leave you guys here i feel like today's vlog was a little bit more interesting than normal but i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys tomorrow bye <laughs>